all right y'all what is going on i hope you're having a good week so far mine's doing pretty good even better today um i just made a random stop into uh, a vape shop um shout out to i believe it's 809 840 tobacco and vape that's the name of the shop uh over off tom hall street 818 tom hall street in fort mill man i tell you what i'm getting ready to view this i've been uh i've been looking for these i saw this in uh gold spectrum cbd's catalog a few months ago and um i was hoping i'd find them finally found one it's called uh, a switch so you switch it's two sides you have an indica and a sativa uh, and you can switch between both sides or you can do both sides at one time uh, i think that's pretty cool uh, unfortunately the review over here isn't very good one says i had an entirely different flavor than what's inside um one of them said dead right out of the package another one says nothing but clogs and one side stopped working only after a few hits so let's hope that doesn't uh doesn't happen to us okay uh yeah i paid like 60 something bucks for this thing let me uh make myself a little bit larger here Uh, on one side, Blackberry Kush. On the other side, Headband Kush. Sativa and Indica. Okay. Cool packaging. Hemp-derived terpenes. They do use CDTs. Now, if you remember, this is this. I, I did a review on these a few months back. Um, these Gold Spectrum saucies, these disposables. You guys remember these? I'll leave a link in the description. These were, other than the three Chi live resin cards, these were the next uh, in line um, as far as natural hemp flavor taste. And also these ghost too, these ghost, these ghost bars were on point. But, so I'm expecting, you know, good flavor from this, very good flavor. Uh, so let's, let's, let's get it open and try it out. Hopefully we have uh, good luck with this thing. I don't think I need the knife. Uh, packaging is tamper proof. I appreciate that. Ooh, okay, very light device. Okay. Uh, says it's ready to hit right out of the packaging. Click one time to switch flavors. Click two times to preheat. Click three times to activate activate both flavors at once. Well, thanks for watching. Let's see what flavor we got first. Okay. It's not hitting. Okay, we got to turn it on. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm not even supposed to be showing myself. And by the way, this video is for educational entertainment and consulting purposes. Think of me as your personal CBD consultant. And <coughs> I will try things so you don't have to. Or if you want to, you can. But I will give you my opinion. So, um, okay, I'm trying to, th what was that flavor? Let me try this again.
I think that's the Blackberry Kush. All right, let's see if we can. All right, supposedly that uh, switched the flavor. Ooh, I can, um, excuse me. I think that was the uh, Blackberry Kush. Uh, let's try the headband Kush, I think. Nope, that's the blackberry kush I got right there. Very good flavor. You can taste the terpenes, the cannabis uh, derived terpenes in there. Wow, the blackberry kush is is really good. Yeah, pretty much spot on with um, three cheese blackberry kush. If you've had that, they have uh, hemp derived terpenes as well. Excuse me. Yeah, shout out to um, what was that vape shop again? Eight four zero Tobacco and Vape. Wow, right off Tom Hall Street in Fort Mill, the only place that I know that carries these. Okay. So that was the Blackberry Kush. Let's try and hit both of them at the same time. Click this button three times. And supposedly you can take a hit from both of them. Oh yeah, I taste both of them. Very cool. Let's go back to the... Uh, I think that's the headband, Kush. Wow, they taste good. Um both of them together. Yeah, the headband kush is really nice. I tell you what. Very good. Hopefully I uh, the disposable the device, you know, stays working well. Excuse me. I like it though. I like the device. Really slick looking. I'm assuming that's your oil in there. USB C. Pretty cool little mouthpiece here. I don't know if you can see the airways. see where they meet together that's where you get uh, the combination of both um, I don't know whether to turn my camera off when I smoke or not I don't know if YouTube's gonna give me a strike hopefully with the disclaimer that they don't they don't mess with it but the pole is really good the draw very light device it looks heavy but it's light it looks sharp i like it presentation is nice i would say the packaging and the presentation it's tamper proof it's really nice it looks uh it, it looks super cool hopefully it keeps working uh seems to be working uh for me well it switches back and forth i can do both at the same time I'll probably put it on the charger just to give it a full. I usually do that anyway with all my disposables. I'll throw them on the charger. <laughs> After I do a review on them and if I'm going to keep them, a lot of times, a lot of them I don't. I have a bunch over there that I'll, you, you know, I'll hit one or two times, don't like the flavor or whatever. So after the review, I'll just throw it, you know, put it over there in the pile. Um, 
I usually try and sell those for like 10 bucks each. They're pretty cheap. I, you know, I'm just, I'm just trying to recoup some money, you know, I'm spending my own money on this. Um, so, which is cool. I was going to buy these things anyway. So why not do reviews, right? Let's switch to, um, the Blackberry Kush. Yeah, almost very similar to Three Cheese Blackberry Kush, and that's one of the best ones I've had. Yeah, this is this is nice. I like the texture on here. It's um, it's not super slippery. So it is textured. This is not. The sides aren't. Uh, but yeah, I can see this sitting in my pocket, you know, and just. I like how it, you know, it's kind of wide, so it'll, it, it should sit down at the bottom pocket without too much, you know, too much movement. I'm, I'm pretty weird. I like to make sure I'm always checking my pockets. I like to keep my um, devices upright as much as possible. That's kind of why I like the compass um, that I use the device because it has a little wallet and you, it's almost very similar to this shape, actually. <laughs> you guys have seen it. My compass, I'm going to do a review on that. Badass device. Been using that for, been driving that for over a month now, every day. But listen to me rambling. It's already 12 minutes. I'm going to go back to the headband. Yeah, I can taste the live, not the live terps, uh, the CDT uh, terpenes in here. So I do yourself a favor. And if you see one of these, pick them up because flavor wise, you can't go wrong. Uh, flavor, I'm going to give it a, um, you know, we don't hand out flavor points too easy here. So I'm going to give it a seven out of 10. I'm uh, 7.5 out of 10. Packaging is 9 out of 10. The device is 9 out of 10. It's, it's, if, if, you know, if I have any issues with the device, I'll let you know. But so far, straight out of the packaging, it's, it's working fine. Uh, okay, so it lights up on the side when you're, when you're taking a little puff, see? Rose gold accents. I can dig it. I can dig it. Good job, Saucy. Good job. Gold Spectrum CBD. Knocked it out of the park. Mm, excuse me. Let me cough again. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Okay, so the Blackberry Kush, the sativa is a mix of D8 and THCO. While on the other side, the indica, the headband Kush, is D8 plus HHC. Ooh, that sounds like a good combo. I like the HHC. Um, it's a good nighttime cannabinoid for me. It, it smacks me pretty hard, almost like a D9 card. The D8 is just a nice daytime cannabinoid that keeps me nice and happy. All right. Well, I appreciate it. Shout out to the vape shop that I got this from. Go check them out if you're in Fort Mill. They only had a couple of these left. I'm sure they're getting more. He said he was. So um, <coughs> look for that. Anyway, y'all keep it frosty. I'll see you later. I will.